Alright, what is up? This little place back somewhere. Dragon Ball Fusions for the Nintendo 3DS. So today, guys, I'm going to be showing you guys how to obtain Cooler and get him on your team. So pretty much, it's a really straightforward process. All you have to do is transport yourself over to map number three or world three. And the most difficult part of this quest is actually finding the location of where this sub event takes place. So pretty much what I'm going to do is scroll over to the bottom screen real quick. And as you can see, there's this time space rift glowing right in the center of the world three map. So if you're like me, you probably were roaming around trying to look for this place. It's actually under this entire floating island waterfall thing. I think it's called under the waterfall. That's like the location area or whatever. I'm not even like entirely sure, but pretty much what I'm going to do is show you guys exactly where to go. And the fact that you need 500 of every single energy type, red, blue, purple, yellow, and green, you need 500. So hopefully you maxed it out or got to that point within the game. You don't have to beat the game necessarily, just as long as you scout enough members and increase the amount that you can hold. So what we're going to do is fly all the way down over here. And this is actually a really creepy area. I'm surprised like nobody really, I guess had a tutorial on this, but as you can see, there's this little like bubble and I was questioning it myself and you can lock onto it. And I was like, oh my God, what is this? Like, what is this thing? And you get closer and check this shit out. The waterfall barrier, that's what it's called. And if you click on it, you need 500 as I stated. So uh, before we get into this, do me a huge favor guys and hit that like button. Let's try to reach 15 likes on this video. It'd be amazing, I really appreciate it. Plus shows you guys wanna see more Dragon Ball Fusions content on this channel. You guys have given me so many recommendations, a shit ton of requests. I'm super thankful and appreciative for all the feedback. Please keep it up. I'm trying my best to pretty much attend to all of your comments and respond to them. If you guys have any questions, definitely voice your opinion or you know any concerns in the comment section below so we're gonna go ahead and unlock this barrier as you can see cooler is chilling right there in the center of this weird little bubble thing and it's it's just like i said it's a little bit eerie just like under this entire waterfall he lies within <laughs> like it's it's just crazy so go ahead and talk to him and it's going to activate i think a uh sub event sub like sub quest event or whatever it's called but here he is cooler my boy this is so cool managed to break through the barrier did you you're obviously pretty strong how about this want me to help you defeat frieza yeah. you know frieza of course he's my baby brother and now that he's sullied the family name he needs to be taught a lesson <laughs> Surely you can use all the strong allies you can get, correct? Taught a lesson? What lesson? I don't know, but I bet it's a bad one. But this guy's no saint either. No way we joined forces with a scoundrel like that, right? Joined forces? Hmm, no thanks. I'd rather not. <laughs> no, because we, we definitely want this man on our team. Like, why not? So I think he's at pretty low level, so that's why I said that you can actually get him pretty early within the game, which is awesome. Are, are you serious, Slow? A wise choice. So first, I'll need to find out exactly where you're, what you're capable of. Take your time to prepare. I want a good fight. Alright, so this is it. The recommended level is 40. This is titled Frieza Clan Saga Brotherly Love. So the rewards are allies and energy. So you'll get a lot of your energy back from what you spent on the 500 for every single one. I know it's a lot, but as long as you, you know, scout members, you can increase that. So the ally obviously is cooler. And this is Final Form Cooler or I think, yeah, this is Final Form Cooler, right? I would assume so. But uh, I know a lot of you guys requested that I do Meta Cooler as well. Uh, we're probably gonna have to hold that one off just because it is through a random space-time rift. Those are really difficult to, I guess, encounter, and it's, like I said, RNG and all that stuff. So, in exchange for lending you a hand, Cooler wants you to show him how strong you are. Well, what are we waiting for? So, you defeat Cooler, and that's it. You get him on your team. So, make sure your team is fully prepared. As you can see, I fused with my boy Bardock finally and it's so epic you're gonna see the like sheer power of this character fused with your custom character it's absolute insanity so let's begin I want to see how powerful you really are oh shit so this is it going straight into battle this is going to be a 5v1 similar to a couple of other I guess space-time rifts or even against like Vegito. I think we did that for uh, the Vegito quest as well. So this is awesome, dude. We're fighting fucking cooler. So I'm just gonna go for some like basic stuff here. Uh, as you can see, I have Pandel. I think that's her name. 
I decided to throw her on my team because Bardock got replaced, you know, because he is fused with me. So I'm going to go and heal, or I guess give my dude some little bit of key so that I can show off the Super Saiyan skill because it looks so dope. But we got Vegito here. And um, yeah, this is a really easy, quick tutorial video. I mean, there's not really much to it. You just go down there. It's like I said, the hardest part was finding where this character was located and how to activate or uh, trigger this space time rift event. That was the most difficult part for me personally because I was like, where do you even find this dude? And then I finally traveled all the way to the bottom. I was like, yo, there he is. So he's almost actually dead here. He doesn't have a lot of health. He's only at level 40. Um, and once again, you guys can get this pretty early within the game. So we got my girl Okda. Uh, what should I use? Should I just go for a key pass or... Hmm... Yeah, let's go for just like a normal key pass. I don't want to drag it out too long, but I at least, you know, want to have a little bit of gameplay footage going on here just for the hell of it. I don't know. <laughs> so we got a special move, but yeah, it's super easy, super easy. Um, I guess we'll go for the key blast here. Just for shits and giggles. I like to, you know, play with my food a little bit, toy around with the guys until we can just completely annihilate. All right, so special move. Um, you know what? I could go for Hyper Gallic Gun and, you know, just finish it off. But no, we gotta go Super Saiyan because it's so fucking dope. Look at this shit. Boom! <laughs> we got our boy. And he's got the awesome headband. This dude is looking like Rambo. Oh, he's got, he got a little bit of power himself. Okay, 170. It's not too bad. But now it's our turn again and we're gonna finish this off properly. Oh shit, okay, I was about to say, let's use Hyper Gall Gallic Gun, but I'm an idiot and I wasted all of my... <laughs> Uh, I think it was like all my key, right? It takes like like five energy. All right, let's go for let's go for just a melee, a quick punch in the fucking face. Check this shit out. Oh shit, I'm right here. Very nice. Dude, look at this, man. This is crazy. This is absolute overkill. So if you're around my same level, you know, like 80 to 100, you're definitely going to kill this guy pretty quickly. But um, you know, if not, it's still definitely doable. You're only fighting one character. And once you beat him, you should be able to get him on your team, which is going to be pretty cool. So we'll check him out and everything, see what move sets he has, and, you know, all his stats and all that good stuff. So we only got, like, 3k EXP. Good enough. All right. <laughs> Just as I anticipated, you're remarkably strong. Well, you've had a taste of my power now, hmm? Yeah, so why do you think we'd want to join forces with someone as shady as you? I mean, he's located under this entire fucking waterfall like i don't i don't understand <laughs> what is it about me that you're afraid of I, i'm not afraid we're leaving slow if you decide you want to join me slow i'll be here waiting for you okay so i guess we would have to talk to him again that's so stupid he should have just automatically what what join our team what the hell <laughs> oh interested in joining forces now are you Yes, please. <laughs> Just get on my team, you garbage boy. Are, are you serious, Slow? <laughs> it's a pleasure to be on the same side, Slow. Yes, I have joined the dark forces of evil and just absolute ambiguity. I don't even know. <laughs> just remember, cross me and you'll live to regret it. How pathetic Frieza is defe being defeated by these apes not once, but twice. These pawns will be perfect for my plans. Oh my god. The alliteration. <laughs> to restore the clan's reputation after that disgrace. Now, let's put my pawns to work. As members of the all-new Armored Squadron. And there it is. Cleared the Frieza clan saga. I guess it's, it was its very own saga and everything. Here we go. We have cooler... A rank at level 40. You can definitely do a lot of cool fusions with this guy. I think I think you can do like one or two. Hopefully, uh, we can you know check him out and everything. But he's got pretty good stats. You know, like I said, he's only at level 40. Uh, he's got monster throw, earthbreaker, uh, attack genius. Ooh, that's pretty good. And royalty. Yep, he is alien. Frieza's older brother who invades planets as well. He's even more aggressive than Frieza and visited Earth in order to fight Goku. So yeah, your standard alien race, Frieza race. And, oh my god, you can actually buy his, I guess, body, like the skin of this character. That's hilarious, I love that. Definitely we'll check that out pretty soon. So, we're going to go ahead and warp back to our spaceship. And we're going to check what this character uh, kind of has, I guess, in terms of EX fusions. Just because I cannot wait until I get all these characters together 
and we do a full-on EX Fusion coverage video or even some like separate showcases. I know a lot of you guys want to see that as well, so definitely we're going to have to try that out. So go to the EX Fusion, go and do that. And where is my boy Cooler located? He's got to be somewhere, somewhere close here. There he is. Okay, so let's go ahead and choose him real quick. Looks like he can fuse with one other character. Obviously, it's going to be Frieza. Um, I was hoping that he would have more, but let's see what this guy would look like. Oh my god! Okay, so just a silhouette alone. He's got, like, fucking six spikes just jutting out of his head. And he looks pretty pretty damn tall, I'm not gonna lie. But uh, this looks awesome. I definitely want this character, like, super badly now. So definitely, I'm gonna have to go look for Frieza on my own time. But this creates an S-rank technique-type character. And you would need Frieza Nose... S, I think that's the S rank, high speed Earthbreaker, as well as Cooler, and our title is Super Alien. So, very nice stuff, definitely going to be showcasing more fusions pretty soon here, and uh, you know, EX fusions and all that stuff, but if you guys have any other recommendations for characters that can be obtained, definitely let me know. I can't get to every single one, and certain ones I've already covered, but uh, I think the next one I'm thinking about doing is either Mira and Tao or even Oob. Because a lot of you guys want to know how to get Oob on your team too. So I can definitely do those because those are, you know, set guaranteed 100% pretty much how to obtain them. Uh, you just follow this basic algorithm and you get it. But the other ones are going to be like RNG based. And if anything, comment down below if you have a question about it. I can definitely respond to you guys and tell you where it's located. It doesn't guarantee that you'll get this character, but at least it's like the first step to show you guys where to go exactly. So hopefully this video helped, guys. Thank you all so much for watching. Leave a like if you guys enjoyed it, and I'll talk to you guys in the next one. Take care.